My name is Giovanni Payo, and this is my letter to President Obama. Dear President Obama, my name is Giovanni Payo. My A number is 096-265-570. I came to the United States in August of 2000. The Asian, the Asian financial crisis changed fortunes of many families, including my own. Indonesia was one of the few countries that were hit the most. As a result, most many lo lost their jobs and, and their faith to the presidency of Suharto as prices skyrocketed. This made, ma this made many Indonesians took their anger out to the streets and created chaos. Their primary modus operandi is to attack the mi minorities such as the Christians. This act tore a hole in the pride of Indonesia found in its slogan Bineka Tunggal Ika which means many, many though united. A year after the devastation, my mother and my father packed their bags and headed straight to the United States in search of the American dream. They left me and my brother behind in the care of our grandparents. At the time, we couldn't understand what was happening and the magnitude of the decision because we were too little to understand. I was a it was a sacrifice they had to make in the hope of brightening the future of our family. Indonesia is still light years ahead behind technology today and even so in 1998 when my parents left. Internet has not yet entered the vo vocabulary and Apple was a giant monitor monitors displaying green letters late in black backgrounds. Neither Skype nor Facebook was available resource to communicate and help shorten the distances created by the separation. My brother and I were forced to celebrate birthdays and Christmas with aunts, uncles, and grandparents, grandparents as they were try, as they tried to help fill the void left by our parents. Toys wrapped as gifts were great help as it produces the smiles needed for birthday pictures. Communication with my parents relied heavily on their efforts as telephone bills would soar if we were if we were to contact them. Conversation lasts short as we would only speak of health, the love we shared, and the promise of our family being united in the United States. Plans of uniting kept secret to lighten the burden and the and to evade the children from all false scenarios. We understand that there is a plan, but we just that don't know what just don't know the time. Early 2000, the progress of the American dream shifted to a new notch. My parents had collected enough money for us to apply for visas and plane tickets to the United States. So we packed up and booked our flights to Jakarta. We prayed hard and our, and our prayers were answered as the United States granted us a five-year tourist visa. My family was no, is no longer separated. We are now united. As I exited Newark International Airport, I saw my parents right outside the gate, waiting with open arms. I ran to them and gave them the biggest hug and kisses I gave to anybody to this day. And then I remember looking around and see the overlapping highways and other infrastructure the other no, that no other nation could ever build. I knew right then I was in the United States of America, the land founded and built upon the Bill of Rights under the, the religious belief that I follow with all my heart. A country blessed with the schools that produces the brightest minds human being has ever known from cities people haven't heard about. I believe that is the American dream and I want in. I, I am a 2007 graduate of Spawning High School up in Rochester, New Hampshire. From there I applied in a local community college using a, using a tax paying number as my social security. I, I prayed and luckily I got accepted as an in-state stu student. After four semesters worth of study, they found out about my lie and sent me a notice letter. I am forced out of school until I receive my documents, the, com the documents I needed. I am writing this letter to you in hope that you may let me and other Indonesians stay. We are not here to steal, kill and destroy, but we are here to find answers on the plans written in Jeremiah 29 verse 11 and 14. I believe that you I believe that the answer we are searching for is here and pray that you would let us stay. Sincerely Giovanni Payo.